For an easy understanding on the different budget components, I recommend you to go to the data panel and extend the list of boundary conditions. Exactly the same order, hydraulic head VC, fluid flux VC, fluid transfer VC, and well VC corresponds to the first part of the components available in the Ray budget panel. We have a Dirichlet VC of 500 cubic meters per day. Green color means inflow positive, red color means outflow negative. We have 500 cubic meters per day. This means that the left and the right boundary of our model domain are prescribing inflow to the system. We don't have Neumanns nor Cauchy VCs because we haven't applied any fluid flux VC nor a fluid transfer VC. We have wells in our rate budget panel with a value of minus 1,000 cubic meters per day. This is exactly the value of two well VC nodes, 500 cubic meters per day times two. We have distributed seen sources, 500 cubic meters per day, positive. This corresponds to the value that we apply via the material property sourcing. 5, 10 to the minus 4 meters per day, multiplied by the area of the model domain, 1,000 by 1,000. Finally, we have a term name, imbalance, 10 to the minus 9. This is a very small number and should be always a very small number because it represents the error of the entire calculation. Normally, you check this value in respect to the other components of the budget. For example, 10 to the minus 9 in respect to 500 cubic meters per day is negligible. Therefore, you can conclude that FIFLO closed the budget calculation here.